Okay, we're going to give you a quick uh, tutorial on how to change your thumbnail icon. It's a good time because I just uploaded this one yesterday. It's a lightning strike video in slow motion. So have a look at that icon. I'm going to hit up here to my video manager. And uh, you can see it right there. And yesterday, this is the icon I had. It's a lightning strike, so uh, you can see the lightning at the bottom. It's bright. And then I changed it to this. Uh, I have two windows open just showing you the difference. See, I'll go back and forth. There's yesterday's and this is today's. It's just the pages are kind of synchronized. So uh, how did I change it? Uh, okay, I'm going to show you. We hit edit. Okay. And you can see the three options they give you. This one's kind of dark. This is the one that they gave me for the second time. And this one, it's a ball in the center, and I think I can do better than that. So I'm going to hit Enhancements up here. Okay, now that's going to show your original video. Uh, we're going to hit Trim up here. Okay, so what I did uh, the first time was edit this video. I took two seconds off the front, and I took like 0.9 seconds, uh, almost a second off the end. And that's what changed up my uh, uh, video icons or, or uh, frames. So I know YouTube, this is uh, March um, 30th, uh, 2012. And I know YouTube used to take one from the center and give it to you. But now they've changed it to like uh, uh, two-thirds over, right? That's why they gave me one of these down here. So for my third time changing this up, I'm going to... Now remember your numbers back you, that you take front and back in case you want to get back to your original uh, thumbnail. So I'm going to take this, throw it right to the end. See, I'm just changing my whole frames back and forth, right? And another good pointer is when I make a video, I always wait five seconds at the beginning so I can do this without disturbing the movie. And uh, obviously I took two seconds off. Uh, when you do get your icon, you click it, you save it, uh, don't go in for like three days. Let it, uh, it, I find it seats itself and then you can go back in and edit it and it'll stay until you do click on the thing. So, uh, here we go. We're going to hit done and then save up here. It's going to tell you they're going to watch the other movie until this one's, uh, processed. So you're going to hit okay on that. It's going to bring you to your movie. There's your lightning strike. So I'm going to take you back to Video Manager. And you can see Edit and Process. Uh, so uh, we're going to get a different icon when that comes up. So you got the tools and the know-how how to do it now. It's all about editing. You go in there and, and juggle your movie around. Uh, I found this out by accident. Just uh, I'm, I'm an amateur and it, it just came across it. And uh, when I was looking, I couldn't find how to do it. And uh, really, this is basically how you do it. So if you can't do, go in there and edit a few seconds off your movie. You're in, there's something seriously wrong with you. You're an idiot. And you shouldn't even be making movies on YouTube. So uh, you, now go in and play. I mean, sometime, once I went in there and it wasn't changing for me. So I, I clicked on this icon and I waited three days, and I came back, and then it changed them up, and I took a different one. So, don't spend all your time at once. Uh, go in, do a couple clicks, and don't come back for like a day or three days, and then have a look at it. Okay, so that's how you do it. Uh, have fun getting the icons and thumbnails that you want, uh, so you can get a lot more views, and uh, thanks for watching the tutorial.